Hello there everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. Today I'm going to review Doctor Who, The Legend of the Sea Devils. I really enjoyed this episode, it was very well built. The characters had a very, well, um, good character arcs. Some of them are new to the show, like Madame Ching and the other guy, um, like So Cho or something. Can't remember his name, but he was like also a captain pirate or a pirate captain. And you have this other uh, guy who wears a necklace, which is very important to the story. But there are no spoilers. I um, have to say, like the doctor and Jazz, or Jazz or whatever, you, how you pronounce her name, they have very well built character development in this episode, which is very cool. Dan, 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 as he's he's my my guy. He's the funniest guy. He's he's just a cool guy. He, I I really like him. And hopefully we'll see him in the next episode because oh boy the next episode is going to be wild but all right i'll get to that but yeah the sea devils are also were also a very important and interesting part of the story um like i said there, there were new characters but they all had different things so you know or you knew why they were there or why they would have certain people that was very cool i really like that i'm going to give this episode a 8 out of 10 but yeah, The Legends of the Sea Devils is a very interesting and very cool episode in my opinion. But alright, I can't wait for the next episode of Doctor Who because it's going to be what? She's going to regenerate, man. And that's always the, the, the craziest part of Doctor Who where, where there is going to be a new doctor. So right, of course there is going to be a 60th anniversary special down the line this year. And boy, I can't wait for that thing because oh my god. If, if they're going to bring back all the doctors, oh my god. Alright, but yeah, alright, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you later. Goodbye, everyone.